What's up, barbarians? Silcon here. This is a uh, this is a build I use in in T6. Uh, just wanted to make a quick video. Um, anyone anyone interested in in what I might be using in T6 uh, can look at this video, and and you'll know. Um, so uh, <clears throat> skills. I'm, I'm using Warcry because I am using a Chalanix chain. Uh, Run with the wind, uh, tornadoes. Um, I think it's run with the wind, right? Uh, run, run like the wind. Um, so I've got a, a speed from Chalanix, speed from run like the wind. Um, Wrath of Berserker gives some speed also, and I'm I'm using uh, I'm using uh, gloves of uh, gloves of worship. Which will enable me to have the fleeting shrine. If I get the fleeting shrine, I'll have that on for ten minutes. Uh, if I get empowerment, I'll basically have Wrath of the Berserker and and call the Ancients on for ten minutes straight. So all that stuff combined, it's uh, I'll be running through these very fast. I'm using a fire build, a fire charge build uh, with a Maximus, um, not full piece ray core, only four piece, uh, because I'm not wearing the gloves. I could be using Royal Ring, but I try to never use a royal ring in any build that I use just because the ring itself is so bad. Um, but I don't really need the dot in T6. I do have one dot going on from Pain Enhancer. It's a fire build, but I'm using Pain Enhancer just for a little bit, a little bit of a dot to finish things off that, that I might not finish things, that I might not finish myself. Um, the uh, the tornadoes from uh, from Sprint will reapply that. The fire chain too does does kill some stuff that that I otherwise might not stop and, and kill. Uh, that that demon pet kind of he'll he'll stay back you know a, a couple screens and that chain will will get pretty long and just uh, as that stuff is beelining to follow me it'll all just kind of come together and and hit my fire chain or hit my tornadoes and that'll do some cleanup. But this build basically the way I'm playing through this build is uh. Is uh, just kill as many elites as fast as possible. So I I, I wear um, Nemesis Bracers to spawn some more. I am running all four, I'm running four passives that are that are all damage passives. I don't use Ruthless. Uh, I use Weapons Master instead of Ruthless. It it really good because I'm using a sword. But you know I, I could use Ruthless, but I use Weapons Master. Um, so I use those four, and, and I do have the Volcathos passive going also. That's on my Hellfire amulet. Uh, didn't craft a lot. We don't really need a Hellfire amulet for any of our builds. Um, but we might in the next patch. Or in the next patch, we might want to have a Hellfire amulet. So it's not a bad thing to look for. But this barb here, you know, I just have this barb put together because I don't need any of this gear on, on any other barb that I play with. You know, all my other barbs have all their gear except for I swap the legendary gems out, but I just have this together. You know, if I'm going to be on for for a couple minutes to play T6, you know, I can. Or if I get on and certain people aren't on that I play with often, I'll run some T6 riffs. Or if I don't want to pay attention, you know, if I just want to play, uh, do, do some loot farming and not really pay attention. I'll, I'll I'll use T6 wrists also because I I don't really need to uh, I really I don't really need to focus on what's going on. I just set my uh, my war cry and my 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 sprint here to auto activate, so they'll refresh. They'll they'll activate themselves as long as I'm not holding down the left click. So I can kind of uh, I can kind of just go to the next elite. And uh, th this build I call it the shoot for center mass because. It's kind of what I'm doing uh, in between killing in between killing elites. I kind of just you know I charge through everything I can charge through. I'm not stopping and trying to make sure it's dead. I'm kind of just charging through the the uh, the densest part of of the mobs that I can. And if they die, they die. If they don't die, they don't die. I'm not really paying attention to it. Uh, I'm just trying to kill that next elite. Pick up the death breath. It drops. Um, because you can't get death breath from uh, from greater rest, and then move on to the next one. You know, I, I don't really. It, it's not. It doesn't really matter to for me to for me to be killing as many whites as I can, or killing all of them. 
uh, or, or being efficient about it. It's not, it's not what I'm using T6 for anymore. Um, so, if if I have a if I have a experience pool, or if I don't have an experience pool, or like sometimes I don't even click the experience pools. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. If I die, it doesn't matter. <laughs> if I if I had an empowerment shrine on me, then I don't want to die. But I, I really, I, I'm really just not even paying attention to to playing. Or I can play this build and not pay much attention, um, which is nice. Like here, my life's getting pretty low. Like sometimes I do die. It does happen. But uh, but you know this barb. This barb is put together such that. I kind of just use this when I want to when I want to loot hunt, and, and it's nice to have a barb together for that, ready to go for T6. You can enter public games if you want to enter public games, or you can just play by yourself. Um, so I've got the Nagel Ring uh, on me, and then I've got the Nagel a Nagel Ring on my follower also, and I think, I think he's got a Hellfire Ring. It doesn't really matter what follower you use. Obviously, you don't have a follower up in uh, in multiplayer games. This is most of the time I'm playing. I'll just enter, you know, random public games and playing those. But um, yeah, th I, I like to have when when I am playing solo, I like to have uh, a Nagel ring and a Hellfire ring on them just for a little bit, a little bit more percent to a couple things. Um, doesn't matter which doesn't matter which follower I'm using though. Uh, I believe I'm using the Scoundrel just because I don't I don't use him for other solo builds, so. So uh, that's one thing about about these individual like individual barbs that have different builds on them. I, I like to have their followers with stuff uh, that I, that I'm not moving in between different builds. It's just a pain to to move any gear or follower stuff, and then remember remember which character you had it on or, or whatever. But um, this one's just complete, fully set up for T6. Nice to have it that way. And uh, and yeah, I, I haven't been doing a lot of T6 rifts uh, since the patch came out. I uh, when they announced the ancient legendaries, I, I basically I stopped doing T6 rifts at that point, and I started doing uh, just bounties or just like greater rifts and, and no T6 rifts because I figured there's no point in finding anything that you know wasn't ancient before the patch came out. So. I did a lot of bounties. I had like 1,800 uh, 1800 uh, Rift Keystone Fragments saved up when, when the patch came out. And I was like, man, you know, I'm just going to do like all these, uh, I'm going to do all these, all these Rifts, <laughs> you know, get, get a bunch of, uh, get a bunch of legendaries, you know, 1,600 or 1,800 or whatever it was that I had. I was like, man, I'll be able to get like almost a full, a full set of Ancients from running all these, right? And, and then I can then I can hit greater rifts after that. Well, you know, a, a day or two into the patch, realize that greater rift experience not not only had does the percent experience do your work, but it it was better. Like just just killing stuff in greater rifts was better. I did I don't, I maybe used like a hundred of those rift keystone fragments. So I still have uh, I don't know probably thir fourteen fifteen hundred left. Uh, I just got stacks and stacks of them on on another character, uh, but yeah, it's uh, you know nice to have a build for this. Uh, this is the quickest the quickest character that I can jump onto and and start doing something. Uh, so that's what I have it set up for, and um, and it's it's very efficient. Like if you like to place T six, it's a it's a very efficient. Uh, build to have set up if you just want to go in kill that next elite after the next elite after the next elite uh, You can do that very very fast